What's up guys, Rex here. Have you ever seen this message? Twitch has failed to export your video to YouTube or whatever it says. Yeah, I've seen that too a lot. Exporting videos to YouTube is a massive pain in the butt and even more so now, now that you got YouTube gaming and Twitch going head to head with each other. So there's some people who have come up with like websites and stuff that are supposed to download your VOD and they just don't work, okay? It's just, they're utter, they're utter messes. Either they have a time limit, size limit, they're just horrible. Or if they even do work, you get horrible like compression and distortion of your video. So roaming around the Twitch subreddit, I came across this program made by a developer named Franiac, Franiac, something like that. And I'm gonna put the link to the subreddit in the description below, as well as the download directly to the program. He has created a program called Twitch Leecher. And as of today, July 29th, 2016, he just released version 1.3 with, as you can see, a whole whack ton of stuff included for like subscriber only VOD downloads and a whole bunch of other stuff. You can read through it here on the screen. Now, I'm gonna show you how to download it, install it, which is pretty basic stuff and how to use it. So let's get started. Okay, so here on the page, as you can see, scrolling past all the notes, we have both x86 and x64 versions of the software and the source code. He did decide to make this thing open source. So if you're a developer and you're skilled at what you do, please help make this project a little bit better. But okay, let's use the x64 one. And the I'm gonna be upgrading on this model since I was already using version 1.6 prior to this video being made. So we're just gonna upgrade for me, but you'll just do a basic install picker directory path as you would. And once that's done, you go up here and you click login to Twitch, okay? From login, you type in your username and password, it'll say authorize, you authorize your Twitch channel, and then you can search your VODs. So click up here, type in your channel name, I'm gonna use mine, LittleRex2015, and it'll pull up all your VODs or your highlights, uh, depending on what you want. Uh, we're gonna download this episode here, last night's After Dark Daily Chat, okay? So we'll click download this VOD, you specify your directory path, you specify your resolution and everything else, and just click download. Now, as this is going, it's gonna look a little bit slow. Now, this is a two gigabyte file that'll be downloaded in about five minutes, okay? Your entire VOD will be downloaded in five minutes, and that's really it. You can see here, it's pretty quick. Obviously, I sped, out, I sped it up a little bit, on the first pass, but the second pass is actually moving in real time. And that's it guys. That's how you download your VODs for free using Twitch Leecher version 1.3. I cannot express to you how much better this makes your life as a Twitch streamer if you are also doing YouTube as well. So guys, thank you so much to Framiac for making the software and making it open source and not charging for it, which I guess makes it open source. And yeah, go get it. Click in the description below. There's the Twitch subreddit and I'll put the link directly to the download. And that's it. This is all you have to do. So like, comment, share, subscribe. Go upvote the Twitch subreddit for this for this post, man, because this guy really deserves it. Give him a gold if you guys can afford it. And other than that, man, I will see you on the Twitch channel. So thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you next time. Bye, guys.